Welcome back to the Mid-Year Mitch YouTube channel. Today's episode, I'm going to show you how to remove your taillight panel, quarter panels, and rear deck section from your C2 Corvette. So be sure to stick around. So this is our victim for today. This car was in the junkyard, the roof was cut off, and I'm working on fixing all of that. And I left the rear fiberglass on here to help line the doors up. But now it's time to take the rear deck off and quarter panels. So the quarter panels are held on with a bonding strip that goes the whole way along here. They're held with the latch pillar here and then the fiberglass floor bonds to the front of it. And then it also wraps around back here. Part of it's missing, but it wraps around to the taillight panel and it went down below. There's also a little splash shield in here that bonds to the floor. So I'm gonna start off by grinding the bonding adhesive out of this joint to expose the bonding strip. We're gonna heat it up and slowly chip our way forward and separate the quarter from the bonding strip. It'll come off in probably several pieces. We'll do the same thing back here. There should be a seam right about here with the taillight panel. I removed all the bonding adhesive in the joint between the deck and the quarter panel and I've been splitting it apart with this panel separating tool works really well. It's nice and sharp there. So it just kind of gets in there, hit it with the hammer and it, the joint kind of blows apart. I get in here with this chisel and just keep a little bit of tension on it. So that way when you hit it, it really spreads open. And what you're looking for when you grind is you can see, well, hopefully you can see it. You can see the white fiberglass, you can see the dark which is the bonding adhesive. And you can see a little more light again, which is the bonding adhesive or the bonding strip. So what you wanna do is put your tool right on top of the bonding adhesive in there, hit it and the adhesive is pretty brittle. So it should just explode out. So I just have a little bit more to do here, do the front half of the quarter and we'll start separating the front of the quarter. Once all this is free, we'll just work on this front area. I'll grind some of the paint off here so we can see the seam really well. And then we'll heat this area up and slowly chip it away to remove it here. And then we'll chip it away from the floor last and then the quarter panel should come off.
So I have all the old fiberglass removed off the back of the car and in the junk pile right there. And right away you can see we got a little bit of work to do back here. Just because, you know, she's a little, she's a little floppy. It's missing some stuff back here. So I have a patch panel here that came from another car that had a bit of a fire. So it has the little half moon or whatever you want to call it section that goes in the back to fit the coupe area. So I need to graft that piece into the car and I would like to set this on top of the car just to see see what it looks like. This thing's really starting to look like a car now that I threw the rear clip on. So I'm gonna pull that thing back off since it looks like it lines up pretty well. The door gaps and stuff look like they'll line up nice. So we'll be able to make a nice car out of this. I'm gonna pull this off, cut a piece of this off, fill that in back there and make the back end of the car somewhat rigid so we can actually start building up a foundation from there. But that's gonna do it for this video. If you enjoyed, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. I have a lot of videos coming up on this project you're not gonna to wanna to miss between fiberglassing, uh, assembling the body, building the doors, building the birdcage. So there's a lot of videos coming up and I got a lot of work to do. So I'll catch you guys later.